Hi, I'm Mark Garland, Product Manager for Raymarine's Multifunction Displays. Today I'm going to take you through our new Lighthouse version 4 software for our C-Series and E-Series MFDs. Lighthouse version 4 adds a long list of enhancements that are going to greatly improve the user experience. It's going to make it even more easy and seamless to navigate. Let's take a look. One of the first things you'll notice is a new and easier way to capture screenshots. Just simply tap the power key and select the capture from the menu. So why do I want to capture screens on my MFD? First, it's a great way to share what you're seeing on the screen with friends. You can share exciting images of fish or bottom structure from the sonar, or you may want to share interesting radar or chart screens. Once the screen captures are saved to a micro SD card, simply copy the images from your micro SD to your home computer. It's that easy. If you want to see examples of some screen grabs, go online and like Raymarine on Facebook to see what Raymarine screens users and pros are sharing. Based on customer feedback, we've added a number of new user interface features to Lighthouse version 4. The first new addition you'll notice is our new on-screen range controls. Changing range scales is very fast and very flexible with the new controls. Plus, you can still change the range with the dedicated keys and the rotary knob. You'll notice how fast the screens update. This is the dual core processor and dedicated graphics processor at work. It really shines when you manipulate the chart and makes operation and navigation so effortless and easy. We've also improved the 3D controls. Now I can easily manipulate the 3D chart with just a few touches. See how easy it is to pan and rotate the chart. The powerful graphic processor in the CNE series gives us a lot of control over the chart layers. And now we've added these nice slider controls for adjusting layers. Here you can see how easy it is to adjust the aerial chart layer transparency with the new slider touchscreen controls. Very fluid and seamless operation. I like it a lot. Some of my favorite enhancements with the new Lighthouse version 4 software is the new touchscreen controls on the radar and sonar app. Let's switch over to the radar and take a look. Okay, I'm going to switch on the new gain controls in the menu. So you'll notice the new icons for gain, rain, and sea clutter adjustments. Let's try the sea clutter control. Just give it a tap and we can now easily switch between automatic and manual modes. I can easily adjust the sea clutter just by sliding my finger across the slider bar. And like the charting app, we've added the easy to use on-screen range controls. This is very simple, very flexible controls of the key radar adjustments. Best of all, I can still use the rotary control knob for the same adjustments. The choice is yours. All right, now let's switch over to the sonar application and see some of the new improvements we've made here. Again, a new favorite feature is the new fish finder range controls. Here I can simply touch and drag the display and change the range. Like the radar application, I also have new gain and time variable gain controls over here on the left. This gives me quick access to the gain controls with just a touch. The TVG controls or time variable gain can be useful for reducing noise that can appear in the water column. Of course, you can also use the auto settings, which work quite well thanks to our ClearPulse digital sonar technology. So you can see we've made a lot of great additions and enhancements to the CNE series multifunction displays with Lighthouse version 4. Lighthouse version 4 is available for free to Raymarine CNE series MFD owners. For more information and instructions on how to download, head on over to raymarine.com.